But it was also unlike you. You say no Murlocs every day. I know, and then I still go for it because I want to play those strategies. Murloc late game is quite good if you make it there. If you actually survive it there, Murloc late game is super strong with with the gentle megas. It's probably like the strongest late game. All right, so could we go Voidwalker or Righteous Protector? Um. Dun, 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 dun. I mean, we might go demons with this, but I mean, even then, like, White Walker isn't that great. It's pretty much the same. Demon LOL. Yeah. How come early Lightfang always wins? I mean, often wins. Don't tell the others. I'm rooting for you. <laughs> no. All right, what do we have here? Okay, that's good. So we uh, we can lock this to get the Diet Hunter because we need to have a token unit. The, the turn three has five, you have five gold available, so you need to sell something if you want to purchase two two things. So please don't get me wrong, I still love watching you play this game. Oh, thanks. I mean, they are nerfing Lightfang. It's already confirmed by Mike Donay. Lightfang is getting a nerf on December 5th. No kidding. Like, it, they actually confirmed it. Developer has said that is happening. Haina is good. We have a little bit of everything right now, which is not optimal, but... Um, but yeah, it's an early round, so... With the Hyena, we can shape this pretty nicely. Hi! Minus 1800 Gek W, by the way. <laughs> Hello. I didn't know McDonald's had... No, not McDonald's. Mike Donay. Alright, chat. We're taking the bait. Hook, line, and sinker. Bogo game? We'll see. I, I might sell them, too. I might also just sell them, chat. I haven't decided yet. Alright, good value trade there. Go left! Oh, we could have gotten a draw if we went left. I mean, if we hit that last one, this is so good. Oh, this actually buffs three things. Maybe I'll sell the Bogos again. I can sell one Bogo and this. This is the Zubat is like too good. No, if I want to level up, I have to. No, I'll, I'll delay the leveling up. Okay. Another zoo, but I think you can win this thing. Cause we're getting like really good buffs, cause it buffs the hyena and the amalgam guaranteed. Yo! Varrix live, thanks for the sub, welcome. Glad to have you with us. Okay, I mean it's a small loss. Don't level up, get the pogo. It's very risky, but let's see. So we're buying this, and then this is up for debate. But I think I'll skip. I, I think I'll roll twice. And then we level up if we don't hit. Yeah, we don't have room for that right now. Looks like you can get a triple. Looks like I can get a triple, chat. Let's do it. Mm 
very nice. Alright, chat, now we get to level up, I guess. Golden Poco Champ! Wait. It almost died already. But for the cost, I mean, that was great. And we have a chance to get even more Bogos now. You should make a custom option to buy your Kek W that costs your current MR rank in cookies. <laughs> what? Ooh. Should we shield the Bogot champ? No. No, we don't need this. Well, this is a cool start, chat. This is a pretty cool start. I don't know exactly where we headed with this, but... Oh my god. I mean, this is a, like a good investment in the future, you know. So that one scales. The Sky Golem would have immediately been a little better. Keep up the momentum, friend. Keeping a hyena? I don't know about the hyena, it's just kind of got the buffs for free. Oh damn, that's pretty bad for me. Should have had the poison more to the front. Based on this. But I mean, we couldn't know. We couldn't know his order. I wonder if we got snipe. Nah, probably not. Just lucky. Gotta start using hero power? Yeah, 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 at least on this poison guy. We actually need to start using hero power. That, that's pretty good. We could get this for a bear. But I'm definitely at least getting this. I could get rid of the hyena. I think we're going mechs, because we have the bogo too. There would actually be some value in this now, but it's, it's too weak. Alright. I'm not gonna tell you what's interesting to you, but to me this has been a very interesting start. Too. Thank you for the six months. Just started playing this yesterday. What's your favorite thing about this game? I think that the alternating heroes are, is really cool. There's two things, okay? First is the permanent buffing. Like, buffing your units when you know that it's gonna like last until the end of the game. And like, the permanent buffing is incredibly addicting. Like, uh, that, that's really fun to me. And second favorite thing is the alternating heroes. Choosing from th three different heroes. Because depending on which hero you're playing, the game can feel very different. Like, playing as George the Fallen is actually very different than playing, let's say, as Nefarian or playing as Patchwork. So, like, the different hero identities, they really nailed that, like, how, how different it is. I think that's also, the like, the X factor on this, how it how it feels so, uh, so much more replayable than I expected. Because when I first... Remember first week that I was playing this, or first days, I was like... I don't know, guys. I think I'm gonna get bored after like few days or something. I, I wasn't sure, but because of all these different heroes, I think it brings so much replayability. Like, look at this: eight different heroes, and they really do have different playstyles. So that's my the different heroes, different hero powers, and the impact of having a different hero power, and the buffing. Okay, those are my two favorite things. Two heroes, not three. Well, <laughs> yeah, but like just having the different ones. Because I, I, I would have expected, like, before playing, I would have expected that, okay, like, the heroes have different hero powers, but they still kind of play out the same and blah, blah, blah. But they actually don't. They don't play out the same. They really don't play out the same. 
There are huge differences, especially if you're a good player. You can really take advantage of some hero powers over others. Oh my god, what a terrible attack for me. Like Nefarian there, holy moly. Okay. Nefarian first took out all the shields. Yeah, that's pretty rough. First took out all the shields and then the big Hydra attack. We needed a taunt to like contain the Hydra. So you need one taunt. We can we can't counter that. We need uh, we need a taunt to counter that one. I'm fighting a dead guy here, so we can kind of chill. Can I make a shield? That's like the big question. Not really. I'm just gonna buy this. So I'm gonna shield this next round. Give it poison. I wonder if this is worth it. It's almost the same as the menagerie magician, right? Because these have poison or will have poison. So plus two health is kind of the same as plus two plus two. Maybe I shouldn't be buying these small buffs. I mean small. I wouldn't buy a Zubat anymore. I might be better off trying to just get the Light Fang for like free every turn. Plus two, plus two. Shield this turn. I don't need it because I'm fighting a dead player. So a dead player, so you can you just know that they're going to be a little bit weaker. So you don't have to worry too much. If I was playing against Rat King, I would definitely be making some power moves here. Like playing all of these and stuff. Because this it would be otherwise there would be a good chance that I would just die this round. But now, because I'm playing as the dead player, there's no way I lose ever. Realistically. Mm. Okay, so Defender of Argus, or even Houndmaster, because we kinda build our own annoying modules here. <laughs> Oh, there's a there's a Houndmaster now. There's also a Hydra, so we're gonna give up on the Hyena now. There's a Defender. Okay. Okay. There's also a Borgo. Oh my god, what is happening? How big is the Borgo? I'm gonna feel really guilty if I don't pick the Bogo. This we need to drop this so we get the buff on the Hydra. I kind of didn't need the Soundmaster anymore because if we got the Defender. That's what I would have picked. Oh well. I can't give it on to this. Okay, I'm gonna get the bog off for memes, if nothing else. Alright. This is pretty early to be having two Divine Shield Poison taunts. Oh, we got the better attack there. Oh! Alright, so don't go to the 19. Okay, that's good. That's good. If it went to this one. Okay, we're fine. 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 We totally fine, chat. We totally fine. Two tally. Mm. I think there's a good chance that we're gonna even get first. It all came together. The early game, we took more damage than I would have preferred, but. I feel like it all came together in this chat. I feel like it, it worked out. Um. Because now I can use like the George more. By this. No. It's there's too many targets. We're gonna waste it a lot of the time. Hey Hydra. Do we want another Hydra? I'm gonna buff this. I'm gonna give it a shield. Try to get three? I don't know. I think I'm gonna skip. Can we do this and sell? We can. It's not the strongest, 
fast, but it'll fight hard. All right. Actually, it might be better on this. Because that's bigger. And this, the smallest minion between the towns, because this is the most likely uh, cleave position. So we're just sacrificing the Veerman Sensei to the cleave gods. Oof. But the two Divine Shields will actually take care of this. Which is nice. We don't have a way to bring back the shield on Cobalt Guardian right now, chat. We need to find the uh, Microbots or... Or something like that. It looks like we're good here. My comp is like, this is set up in a very like professional way. <laughs> if I, <laughs> that sounds weird, but that's how I feel about this. Like we have things in like very methodical way. Let's, let's say, let's call it that. Got the two taunts, we don't want more. We got the exact two taunts, divine shield, poison. It's like optimized. This is like textbook uh, defense, you know. Mm, top four. That's good. Ooh. Oh my god. So good. It's not really a waste. We still get three perfect ones. Oh, that was a terrible attack. We need to get the shields from here. Get the shield from this. No! Okay. Well, not the worst. I think we're still good. We're still good. Oh, he got the better. Wait, are we good? I don't know if we're good. I should leave, though, even if I lose this. Okay, it looks like we lost, but I think I, mean, I will leave. I'm not dead. We can fix this. We can fix this. It's okay. There are ways for me to get stronger. Hello, Mr. Savage. I'm sending this highlighted message today to inform you about this great product called Prime. Prime? What does that do? Can I hire three of these recruits? Wow, cold and legendary! Legend Wowie! It sounded like Mr. Chang. Cold and legend Wowie! Okay, let's do the. Let's do cast coiler, put it here. Because now if this gets cleaved, like this will. If, if the cast coiler dies to the cleave, so will the light thing. And then we get two, uh, two death rattles. Racist. No, Mr. Chang from, like, the, you know, the GTA RP. That was not, that's not racist at all. Oh my god, you guys. Alright, anyway. Oh, it's gonna steal the buff. Well, that's not true, because I'm gonna avoid the buff, and I'm gonna buff this instead with my skills. No, 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 don't attack him with that one. Nah, I think this is good. Because this snack, big snack is gonna give us two things. Yeah, we're still good, chat. We're Gucci. Easy win, actually. Wow. This looks so pretty, like the lineup, chat. I don't know about the Pogos, like, they're a little bit like. Like, I don't usually have Borgos, but hey. It seems to be working. The one thing missing is the Microbots for Cobalt Guardian. Yeah, that's right. Borgos is the cheerleader. Alright. Okay, we need to get a shield on the Hydra here. I mean, this would technically, like, maybe, but it's too hard, no. 
Oh. <laughs> Jay Berto. Better hire a recruit while you can. You better shut up, Bob. I know what I'm doing. <laughs> Rude. Oh no. Oh. Uh. Damn, this lineup is so pretty. Oh, that was a bad attack. I think we're still good. We good? Oh my god, it's not even close. Not even close! If the snake goes off, I think we have a... Okay, let's see. Can we kill him? No, this is not big enough. I was thinking that if we if we get big enough max, that he would maybe be dead. Nice work out there. Keep up the pressure. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm against a dead player. So we can like... We could even level up or we could stack buffs or... No, I don't want to level up, because I want to make a shield again. Find the microbots. Go ahead and hire one of these recruits. Not finding the microbots. I'm gonna shield this, because there could be some cleaves, like... There's no benefit in this dying. <laughs> so it's better if it lives. There's sort of a benefit in this one dying sometimes, maybe. Not really. I think I'll shield that too. Go ahead and hire one of these minions. More space for cast coiler? Yeah, well that's yeah, but if we, if we shield that too, it can't really happen. Oh my goodness. I am fighting a ghost though. Yeah, we crushed him. I mean, he died like three turns ago or something. Uh. Ghost behind you! Oh no. Go ahead and shield one of these minions. 27! Oh my god. Alright, down to two. And we just kicked Patchwork's ass too in the last round, so... I am very confident. That we're gonna be able to finish this off. I don't even know what I'm looking for. Two more Bogos. Okay, that's good. That's what we wanted for next. I mean, if we somehow don't. No, I mean, it's gonna be over. It's gonna be super. This is so over. This is so freaking over, Chuck. Good GG game. Good GG. Very good GG. Golden light fang. Seven bubbles. You got this. You're way ahead. Only Nefarian can beat this, I think. Dicus Picus. Thank you for the sub. Thank you very much. Good to have you with us. Yep, yep. Maybe like my Exna would have been like a nice addition. Replace this with my Exna. Because the things are getting so big. The Bogo Hopper isn't really that strong. But with all those shields, like, this survived instead of dying. So. <laughs> like, just imagine, like, if I didn't have the George the Fallen Divine Shields, this would have been dead. This would have been dead. This would have been dead. I mean, this would not have been dead because it has a shield without George, but. But I guess we still would have won. <laughs> we would have still won if these were dead. Even if these were dead, we would have won. Wow. That's how far I was ahead. Well, that was not close, Chad. That was not close. Absolute domination with George. 